Sarah Shelton and Patrick Henry were childhood friends who fell in love and got married as teenagers. After the birth of their sixth child, Sarah became emotionally unsettled, would often act out violently, and sometimes had to be restrained in a straight dress, an early form of a straight jacket. A year prior, a hospital had been built in Williamsburg, used specifically for the treatment of the mentally ill. Patrick, a politician, was familiar with the asylum from his trips to the capital, and he knew that oftentimes patients were mistreated. Treatments would include bleedings, dunking people underwater. So being a man of means, he decided to have a room set up in his basement, had one of their slaves assigned to look out for her well-being. Also, their oldest daughter and husband moved in to help as well. Despite their best efforts, she died a year later, most likely of suicide. She was 36 years old. Patrick, who was going to be running for governor the following year, didn't want the controversy to get out. So she was buried in an unmarked grave, they think about 30 feet outside of the basement door.